Ooh, hello everyone today uh, my vlog is planned and not planned at the same time I almost got into accident because many people they don't know traffic rules or even if they know they just don't give a shit so I was very upset because of dogs and almost traffic accident but anyway I still came to the area which is student dorms right now I was in this building I found a young couple there I asked them to show me the room let's have a look from outside the building looks okay but inside looks like a lot of issues here the doors everything not in the best shape and condition so this guy is year four and they told me that the room in this place in this dorm for one year cost 89 dollars which is almost 900 thousand keep looks like he lives on the third floor maybe fourth i hope it's on the three floors okay almost there everything would be so nice at this place and not these doors is it okay with this yes okay thank you <laughs> so by the so one two three four uh, three. Oh, three. Okay, so here, here is the bathroom, and the light is not the best, but it's fine. From the very beginning, the idea was good, but again, these doors. Did you do this? It's you? No, it's not. So there are four beds, but three of you here, three boys. Okay, there is like the wardrobe area, shoes, clothes. This is your table where you do your homework. You're a good student, right? <laughs> so which one is your bed? This one? Yes, this one. This is your bed. Okay. You have nice teddy bear. <laughs> Very cute. Ah, oh, somebody sleeps here. Yes. Ah, and the balcony, right? <laughs> Can I have a look at the balcony? Okay. No aircon. No. There are one fan, there are two fan, no aircon, and a little balcony. Boys as boys, not everything looks perfect. Thank you guys, thank you very much. <laughs> nice to see how Lao students in Lao University live. So you study at Lao National University, right? Yes. Okay, and something with French? Yes. Okay. I will not ask more because we won't <laughs> understand each other, right? You understand a little bit? Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> and I will continue to explore some other buildings. So as you see from outside these buildings, they look very okay. They do some certain renovation from outside from time to time. And I think it was built not so long ago. But inside, as you saw, the condition is not the best. In the room where I've been, they don't have aircon, but few rooms have aircon. So maybe some other people, students who were living here, they did it for themselves, or or these rooms must cost much, much more than those which we just saw. So every building has the same idea. There is a meeting room. There is concierge, which is not there. And looks like they are doing renovation in the whole building. I will not go there. Don't really want to get into trouble. I see they are fixing the doors, the walls. Okay, let me try to get inside. So this is the bathroom. A little bit of renovation. It looks like they are changing here. This is the wardrobe. They are probably going to make a new one. And these are the beds. So this is the other room and here aircon. Feels like some Chinese students were living here. And the balcony. So there is like volleyball area. There is basketball area and there is football area just in the center of this compound. Lots of students still here. Lanterns. 
they do renovation in the whole building so here is one more building but it's gonna be all the same what we just saw here is even coffee shop oh wow that's great no coffee in the coffee shop i'm not sure why you see number eight where was number five that is number two do you know how many buildings here a1 and a Eight. Ah, so only eight buildings. Yeah, eight building. Ah, okay, because I thought it's too much. Okay, so only eight. And how about this one? Is it for Chinese students? No. For foreign uh, students? Yeah. Chinese and Vietnamese. Uh huh. Chinese, Vietnamese. Uh, Myanmar. Myanmar. Cambodia. Cambodia. Yeah. So this building, A5? A7. A7 is for. For foreign, st foreign students. Student, yeah. Because in one room I saw Chinese sign. So this is not for Lao, right? So this yeah. A8 is for Lao students, right? Yeah. Okay. So that's why for international students they they renovate it, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So th this building is different. Yeah. Okay. I will go to see. <laughs> anyway, thank you. <laughs> this building, they have air cons, lots of rooms. They all build in the same way. Okay, here are the doors. So far looks better. The walls are not that great. Looks like the doors were changed, but the condition of the building is definitely not the best. I hope it's gonna be cleaned one day. I found one more guy to talk with from this building, A8. Here? Yes, here. Can I see the room? Wait, buddy, come on, I need a net. You have aircon. Yeah. Aircon, you have fan, and this room looks, looks clean, new. Mm -hmm. This one changed, right? Yeah. They changed it. You have TV. Yeah, TV. And fridge. And water. So it's fridge yours? It's you? No. Um, uh, ah, they give you? Yes. And TV give you? Yeah. Okay, and cattle give you? Yes. And this give you? This, 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 is, this, this is mine. This is yours. Mine. Or they give you? It looks like they give. Because yeah. you all have the same. So how much do you pay? No, free. For free? Yes, for free. For the room? Yes. You don't pay? Yes. And my uh, company. Ah, your company pay? Yes. Ah, so you don't know? Yes. Anyway, thank you. Okay. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Sorry for disturbing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm leaving. Bye bye. I'm leaving. <laughs> bye. Look, this room has even a door like this. I don't know it was this door was done by by the like university or by some people who just gonna live here in the future so as you see it's difficult to judge because from outside this building looks like this inside as you saw the room i've been right now looks new renovated slowly slowly one by one they renov renovate rooms there is one more building. Office of Dormitory Management. Ah, okay. Dormitory Management. Oh, look at him. Come on, you so sweet. So small. Is it yours? No. No. So this is a one building. Let's have a look. At least here, at the door, at the very beginning, it doesn't look like it looked in the previous buildings. The doors and everything here looks good. The walls a little bit dirty, but not that bad. Okay, Chinese students. Okay, I will not ask these girls to get inside because what I can say, what I just saw, it's all the same. Ah, here is water. I was wondering, what is this thing? It's for water. This building looks clean nothing wrong with this building all the doors on the first floor looked really good now let's go to the second floor in this building all the doors are good 
look new doors this building a1 this is also for student uh, for foreign students that's why it looks more or less okay from outside and inside here this dorm is for girls on the first and the second floor only two people can live on the third and on the fourth floor three people live there is one more shop here but doesn't work camera doesn't really see what I see but I would say that this is not the best shape and not the best condition dorm and the rooms here kind of okay but not okay this is how people try to leave the whole day this is definitely still not renovated dorm and I feel like it goes dorm yeah from this point I can say this building is not renovated and the rooms are here very cheap okay thank you of child for information bye no don't be shy <laughs> okay this lovely girl she explained me a lot and made it more clear for me so now I know Laos students they pay almost 900,000 for a year for these conditions foreigners there are only two buildings for foreigners there are three four people in each room and they pay one million uh, five hundred or one hundred fifty dollars for a year this is the basic information about the prices and uh, the conditions of dorms for uh, Lao students and international students at Lao National University here is one of the entrance because I came with the other entrance and one man just right now he came to me with his motorbike he looked angry he said where are you going I said, I'm going outside I'm leaving I'm leaving no worries so he said you should go this way oh my god look at this oh, it's better not to drive and not to walk here when it's night time and to be honest I have no idea where I'm now okay guys that's it for this episode it's not the last about uh, Lao University and Lao dorms Dondok area it's not the last there is one more dorm area which I will show you also in one of my next episodes uh, that is something to be shocked I'm, I'm telling you now this place where we've been now looks good decent great I would say if to think and to compare with the other place I'm talking about now anyway that's it for today and see you next time bye